Man, have y'all ever had that moment where you're just looking for something, looking for something, and you just wonder where it's at? Oh, man, I had that the other day. It was French L6. I was determined. We're going to talk about another time. But I was determined to find some French L6. And let me tell you, someone told me Burger King had it. And one day, I was like, before I get to work, I'm going to try, try it out. So I drove to Burger King, and I was like, hey, let me get some French toast sticks. You know, the lady told me, we don't have that. I was like, all right, well, goodbye. <laughs> I was determined to find it, but I found it in Sonic. Oh, man. And then I forgot the syrup, too, because you got to have the syrup with the French toast sticks. But I just had the, I just had the French toast sticks by itself. But it was still good. It was what I was looking for. It was what I was looking for. So I, I care less if I had syrup or not. You know, I was just looking for French toast sticks, and that's what I found. Praise be to God. <laughs> yeah. do, uh, do, do you understand what I'm saying? That's determination. Trying to find something that you've been looking for, but you're looking for, looking for, and you finally find it. Oof. You made a way. Yo, what's going on, guys? How you guys doing? It is Perky Talks. Let's get straight into this video. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Listen, we want to talk. We want to go talk back. We're gonna go and talk again about discipline. Discipline. Reason why? Because discipline isn't just this easy thing. It just isn't this uh, this this thing that you just wake up and you just have. It's not something that you can just obtain. It's not something that is it's just there. It's not you know like oxygen is just there. Oxygen is there. Um, um, water is is there, right? But you have to go get water, right? You have to go and get it. You have to move from your position currently and go and get water wherever it's at, right? Um, that's the same with discipline. Discipline is a substance. Discipline is like a substance because uh, with discipline, you have to go and get it. You have to obtain it. You, it's not something that you could just have and say, I am disciplined this morning and I feel great. No, it's something that you just have to apply to yourself, apply to your life and say, you know what? I'm going to have discipline in the area of working out. I'm going to have discipline in the area of eating right. I'm going to have discipline in the area of finances. I'm going to have the discipline. I'm going to have the discipline in the area of boosting my credit score. You know, whatever, whatever your situation is for discipline, discipline is the substance of, of what you're trying to accomplish. Discipline is the substance of what you're trying to get because it's not easy just to have discipline. It's not easy just to also be disciplined. It's not easy just to have that. So that's why it's a substance. That's why you have to go and get it. Every day you got to wake up and, and, and encourage yourself to be disciplined and set out marks of discipline so that you can be disciplined, so that you can achieve that discipline, so that you can be able to do what you got to do for that span of time. So that's why I say discipline is a substance because it's not something that is, once again, easily attained. I know I've said that about three different times right now, but it's true. It's not something that's just easily attained. You have to set out marks for yourself. So let's just say if you want to have a goal of working out, if you want to have a goal of work, let's put working out eating together, right? Two things together, right? You say, I want to work out, I want to work out, I want to eat right. Okay, so now we have that goal, right? Now we have to be disciplined in order just to do it. If you're saying to yourself, I want to wake up at 4 o'clock in the morning just to go to the gym and work out and da da da. Okay, so now... You set your alarm, right? That's the first part. That's the first part of discipline. You set your alarm. You set your alarm uh, for four o'clock because you're going. You're going to the gym. You have your clothes set out so you don't have to go look for them and you don't have to go search for them. You got your shorts out. You got your you got your uh, your t-shirt out. You got your running shoes out. You have everything that you need for to go and run, to go or to go walk, to go do what what it is you need to do or what is that you set out to do, right? So now you have all of that, right? So now you're saying, all right, so I'm going to spend two hours in the gym. So now when you're in the gym, guess what? Your body's like, man, tired. Man, I don't want to do this. Man, can we just go home? Can we, oh, please, can we just go home? 
I'm just so tired. And then you lessen the time, right? Because you're tired, you listen to your body. But if you set that discipline in your mind saying, you know what, I have a goal to accomplish. I have a goal to make. So I can't just quit in 30 minutes. I got to go that full 45 minutes. I got to go for that full 60 minutes, whatever time you put on the treadmill, right? You're saying to yourself, no, I'm, I'm, we need to be disciplined. We need to, we need to be able to just to shut out our minds and say, you know what, I've, I've got up 4 o'clock in the morning. For a specific reason, for a specific cause, and that specific reason, specific cause is so that I can work out, so that I can um, live a healthier life, so that I can live a better life. So, okay, so no, so no, we're not going to quit. So, no, we're not going to just uh, throw in the towel. We're not going to just uh, give up in a short span of time. No, we're going to push through. We're going to keep on going. We're going to we're going to let our body uh, know that. Uh, it's not going to stop. It's not just going to give up. That's not what we do. That's not how we're going to do it. That's not the way that we're going to do it. No. So we're just going to keep on pushing. We're going to keep on pushing. We're going to keep on going. We're going to keep on going no matter what, no matter what. And then once you finish that two hour workout or hour workout, whatever it is that you, that you've already set on your little goal sheet, and then you're going to come home, you shower, um, now it's, it's, it's even breakfast time now, right? So now. Instead of eating always, instead of always eating bread and bacon, ham, all that, all the works, start start to say, you know what? Let me cut out bread. Maybe maybe bread is my problem. Okay, so you start to cut out bread, and then you start to go start to see what 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 is beneficial for your body and what is not beneficial for your body, and start to go through that. Start to say, uh, start to have that discipline to say, you know what? I'm going to I'm going to take out bread for for thirty days. And, and see how your body reacts to the bread thing for 30 days. Say, oh, I'm not going to eat rice for 30 days. Okay, see how your body's going to react to that. You're going to start cutting your stuff out of your diet so that your body, so that you can see how your body is going to react, so you can see how your body is going to take it. But that's all about discipline. All of that, all those steps is about discipline. So if you want to eat right and go to the gym, all you have to do, all those steps. And it's all about writing that down, writing that process down. Don't just say, oh, I want to eat right and I go to the gym and I weigh at this much and and that that's it. No. Start writing out your plans. Like, how are you going to do it? From step one all the way down to step 20, if it takes 20 steps just to do it. And that's what all, that's what, that's how, that's how you be disciplined. Because you're going to look at that, like when you go, before you go to the gym, you're going to look at that and say, okay, so step one is actually getting up at four o'clock in the morning. Okay. Right. The step one is actually putting my clothes out at nighttime. Okay, cool. Step two is actually get up at four o'clock. Step three is this, is this, is this, and go through that, and 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 have those steps with you while you're going on this journey. Have those steps with you while you're doing all of that stuff. That's personal development stuff. That's that's discipline. That's that's how you that's how you get it done. That's how you get it done. That's how you manage it. But discipline is not something you just wake up and just have. Discipline is something that you have to go and get. Discipline is something that you have to go and uh, obtain it. Discipline is a serious thing in life. It's a serious thing. I know we discussed it last week. I know we're discussing it today. But discipline is a serious thing. It's a substance. Just like you need oxygen to, to, to live. Just like you need water to live. Just like you need food in your body. Yes, you can survive off of food for a while. I understand that. But you know what? You still need it. You still need the proteins. You still need the iron. You still need everything that that meat has, that the, the, the vegetables have, the vitamins, all that. You still need all of that for your body to function, for your body just to act right, for your body just to flow right, for your body just to be right. You need all of that. And all of that is discipline. You got to incorporate discipline. That's what discipline is. Discipline is the oxygen. Discipline is the water. Discipline is the food. Discipline is the vitamins. Discipline is, is all of that. That's what discipline is. But if you're, if you're just going to be disciplined one day and not the next, then that's not, that's not the way to go. Discipline is a constant thing, a constant thing, day after day after day after day after day after day. Like I said, you can't just be disciplined one moment 
And the next minute you're like, oh, well, forget about it. I tried it. Didn't really work. No, you got to work at it. Work at it. Day in, day out. Work at it. Day in, day out. Work at it. When you don't, when you really don't want to work at it, work at it. When you don't want to go through the process, go through the process. When you don't want to um, continue on and on and on, continue on and on and on and on. Because that's how you have your freedom. That's how you have your breakthroughs. That's how you have your dreams, your goals uh, come through. That's how you have all of that. But discipline starts when you make that one conscious effort to go forward, to go ahead and do what you got to do. That's that's what it's all about, ladies and gentlemen. That's that's what it's that's what it's all about. That's what it has to be all about. It's not about just doing it once and that's it, or just doing it this and then that's it. But no, it's a constant thing. We go on and on and on. Like I said, it's a substance. It's like you need oxygen, just like you need water, just like you need food. You need all of that. So when you don't have water, you get dehydrated. When you don't have food, you get malnourished. When you don't have oxygen, you die. Die. You die. So just like you need all of that, discipline is all of that. It's all, all of that. It's true. That's what discipline is. Discipline is the substance. Come on, y'all. I know this. Discipline is the substance. Remember that. Always keep it in your mind. Hey, I'm gonna have to get going. It's Perkins Toast. Uh, I need, I need like a hundred subscribers. I'm, I'm only like one away. Just one away. I'm getting a hundred subscribers, so subscribe to the channel. Um, we have new shirts that's gonna be posted up. I'm gonna show y'all what the new shirts look like, so y'all can see what the new shirts look like, so y'all can get a taste of what the new shirts look like. And I'll tell you, they are beautiful. They are beautiful. So you want to get your hands on these. You definitely want to get your hands on these. Um, and then later on, we're gonna come out with another one. So y'all just want to stick stick with this, all right? Hey, it's Perkins Talks. I definitely see y'all next time. I definitely talk to y'all next time. And why not? So, take care, y'all. Bye-bye.